हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू क्लास सिक्स मैथ्स चैप्टर फोर बेसिक ज्योमेट्रिकल आइडियाज स्टूडेंट्स लेट अस स्टडी अबाउट कव व्हाट इज कव कव मींस द फिगर्स दैट कैन बी ड्रॉन विदाउट लिफ्टिंग द पेंसिल फ्रॉम द पेपर आर कॉल्ड कव्स सो इन मैथमेटिक्स अ कव कैन बी स्ट्रेट दो इन कॉमन लैंग्वेज इट्स नॉट सो सो वेन वी ड्रॉ cow we cannot see that cow is a straight but in mathematical language we can say that cow can be straight so from this figure you can observe students according to the definitions these are the figure are drawn without lifting pencil here also this is a circle that is drawn without lifting pencil this is also drawn without lifting pencil so these are the example of cow Now, students, what is simple cow? If a cow does not cross itself, it is called a simple cow. What is open cow, students? A cow which does not end at the starting point is called an open cow. Closed cow, a cow which ends at the starting point is called a closed cow. Let us understand this with an example. students here is an example of an open and closed figure so what was the definition for open figure that a curve which does not end at the starting point is called an open curve so here you can see that this is a curve suppose this is a starting point so this is a curve which does not end with the starting point hence it is an open curve suppose this is a closed curve it is a closed curve so here the definition is that a curve which ends at the starting point so this is a starting point if we draw this it ends with the starting point it is called closed curve it is also simple curve why simple curve because the definition of simple curve is that if a curve does not cross itself so here there is a curve which is not crossing itself hence it is also called simple curve now these are the two figures The first figure is a closed figure. There is an inside and outside to the shape. To get from inside to outside, you must cross the boundary of the shape. This is an open figure. It is not closed. So there isn't an inside or outside. Even a portion that seems enclosed can be reached without crossing the boundary of the shape. So here, according to the definition, it says it says that it does not ends with the starting points, and this is a figure which ends with the starting point. Polygon. What is polygon, students? A polygon is a simple closed curve made up of line segments. The line segments are the sides of polygon. Let us understand these definitions with one example, students. This is a figure. What is the definition? A polygon is a simple closed curve. Now, simple closed curve means it is not crossed itself. So, this is a simple closed curve, and this is an example of polygon with line segments. Quadrilaters. What is quadrilater? Quadrilater is a type of a polygon with the four sided. A four-sided polygon is a quadrilater. It has four sides and angles. So here, which are the four sides? A, B, B, C, C, D, and D. A. Four angles: angle A, angle B, angle C, and angle D. So these are the four sides and angle. Sides means what, students? The line segments that form a polygon are called the sides of the polygon. Now let us understand about adjacent sides. any two sides of a polygon which have a common end point so for example here if i take dc and cb so which is the common end point c so it is called this both are the adjacent pair similarly if i take da and ab so what is the common end point a so these both are adjacent pair so they are known as adjacent sides now what are vertices the point where two sides of a polygon meet is called its vertex and the plural it is known as vertices for example here a vertex a vertex b vertex c vertex d so these are known as vertices thank you